What's up guys, welcome back. This is Life of Acro, I'm Acro Brandon, and this is my life. Today we're gonna ask the question, can you use the GoPro Hero 9 Max Lens Mod setting without a Hero Max Lens? We're gonna ask the question, and we're gonna answer it. So I've seen this question asked a lot on YouTube on different videos and different people's profiles. Can I use the Max Lens Mod setting to get 360 stabilization so that way when you tilt your cameras left and right, you get that 360 horizon lock instead of stuff going upside down. So we're actually gonna take a look at what it looks like if you've tried the Hero 9 or you're just thinking about buying it. Typically, if you have the linear and horizon leveling on, the camera will stay fairly level up until a point, but once you go beyond 90 degrees, degrees the image totally rotates and it's upside down so that's the allure of having the max lens is that as you go around in 360 degrees it's always perfectly level you never have any issues a lot like an insta 360 so let's take a look at the gopro and see what's going on right now on the camera on the gopro we're shooting in 4k 30 linear with horizon leveling shutter speed at 60 GoPro color on because I feel, don't feel like doing any correcting after this. And we're just going to look at going to the left, to the right. We can change it back and forth and it tends to do a pretty good job. However, when you decide to go for a full barrel, you'll notice it goes upside down and then it might correct itself. Or if I was to go from here to the back, it would be upside down. Yes. And then it comes right side back up if I'm over here. Let me try this the other direction, right? Here's my gold reflector. Here's the mirror. Back up. All right, so now we're actually gonna try it with the Hero Max Lens Mod setting on. You do need to make sure that you have a horizon leveling enabled on this feature, and I don't know why. Why wouldn't you? Uh, it also doesn't give you many options. It's preset, 2.7K, 60 frames per second, okay? In super view, supposedly. Okay, so here I am in front of myself. Okay, if I tilt it left and right, it should stay really stable. And actually, I'm going to get the camera even closer so that you can watch that as I start to rotate it for a barrel roll, the camera stays, or the image stays perfectly level, which is nice because then you can take something like this where I'm looking at myself and go right behind myself and it writes itself. And then as you come back from this rear view, you're back to looking at yourself once again. It gives it a nice little flip at the top, which would make it more interesting because if you wanted to whip it over your head, kind of like bullet time, even though this isn't a 360 camera, what kind of a, an image do I actually get out of this? Yes. So for me, where this would really shine is if I am turning and I'm riding on a skateboard or snowboard or something like this, and I want to switch my views, and I'm holding it here, I could come around the corner, right, and then I could take it up and over the shoulder and get behind me, depending on what kind of a view it is that I really want. Uh, for me, I feel like um, the super view or the max lens would actually open things up and give me more viewing area, of course, which it's supposed to do, but it's really interesting how this is working. Okay, so there you have it. Hopefully that helped. Hopefully that helps you understand the Max Lens mod setting and the ability that you can use it without the Max Lens. Personally, I think if you don't need something cinematic where frame rates don't matter, where you don't need to have the 180 rule, and you just want to go out and make sure that your footage is stable and horizon leveled and looking good whenever you're rotating the camera back and forth, it might be a good option. Maybe if the selfie stick was just a little bit longer, that would give you a little more depth and range to capture more within the lens since it's not a max lens. But at the end of the day, it's gonna be level the entire time and it's gonna look awesome. All right, I'm Acro Brandon. I'll see you in another video, Life of Acro.